Hey babes, this video I'm going to be doing this Get Ready With Me. Basically tonight I'm going to be seeing Raja in Leeds, which I'm so excited about. And I haven't seen a Drag Race girl in ages. The only two Drag Race girls that I've seen is RuPaul when I did Drag Race UK and Pearl, I saw Pearl. I've not seen any Drag Race queens in real life for such a long time. One of my favourite seasons was season three and Raja was just amazing and I can't wait to see her. But yeah, that's it guys, enjoy the rest of the video. Ugh. I literally have not filmed in so long. Let's go. I'm popping my Desio contacts in. Nivea aftershave balm. Now, if you want your face to be dry and matte the whole night, then go for this. But if you want your face dewy, this is not the one. <laughs> to cover up my 5 o'clock shadow, I'm going to be using my LA Girl Pro Conceal in Orange Corrector. I'm just going to put it in my beard area. Most of the time, I don't really do this just because, like, I can't be asked. <sighs> eh. But today is a special day because Raja is special. <laughs> I'm going to be using my Makeup Forever HD foundation in Y435. And um, yeah, this is real tan, but I'm just going to cover up with a lighter concealer anyway, so that's fine. <laughs> I'm going to be using the Make Forever Full Cover in number 5 and just highlight my face with this. I'm going to go in with this highlight. I'm going to go crazy. Oh, I'm going to be using my LA Girl Pro Conceal in Beautiful Bronze. Just the contour. Have you seen Alyssa Edwards' makeup tutorial on YouTube? No. Oh my god, it's terrible! <laughs> oh, the way she doesn't make up. Um, you guys that love Alyssa, I love Alyssa too. Uh, she's great at what she does, like the dancing and everything. She is no Miss Fame. I mean, like honestly, the overall effect, when you see her on stage, when you see her on camera, it looks quite good. But when you see like the details of how she does her makeup, all tea, all shade, I'm just telling the tea. Like, it's just the truth. I just don't like the way she does her makeup. So, yeah, you guys, you guys are gonna hate me basically. I'm gonna do a bit of baking with my Avon Loose Powder in Fair. I've not baked in a while actually. Now I'm going to be doing my brows. <coughs> Oof. Freedom Dead Brow Pomade in Medium Brown, that's what I'm going to be using for my brows. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to conceal with my OCC Skin Conceal in Y1 to snatch them brows. What have you guys been up to? Tell me in the comments below, how have you been? Um, I've been really, really enjoying um, keeping in contact with you on social media, like Instagram, like your DMs. Thank you guys for always messaging me on Instagram and stuff like that, like I really appreciate it and like you ask for my advice and stuff and I'm like, ah, yeah. I don't really know what to say but I try my best. For eyeshadows, I'm going to be using my Makeup Geek eyeshadow palette. I'm just going to be using a bunch of colours, I'm going to leave it down below because I, I've got to get ready. I'm popping a purple into the crease. I have been working the past four months in Kiko makeup and a lot of you guys have met me throughout my time in Kiko and I have left. Um, my work there. I've honestly loved meeting you guys so much. It's, it was one of the best, best parts of working for Kiko was that I got to meet you. And it honestly makes me think so much. I'm deepening up my crease with the purple. It honestly makes me think so much like how grateful I am to like meet you guys and like have you guys around. It's so lovely. Honestly, I love taking pictures with you and thank you guys for making my day every day whilst I was at work. I also said it on my Snapchat that I was leaving my job and on my last day of work people came 
to like take pictures with me and to say bye, which was so nice. And I want to do a lot more meetups in the future, definitely. Ooh, look at that! Mm, mm, mm. I'm using my Becca Opal. No, this is a champagne pop actually. And I'm popping that into the brow bone. I'm gonna put a yellow right onto my lid. Just all over. Did you see the new season 8 super trailer? Sick! If I want to do ratchet drag next week, can you give me some tips? Well, if you want to do memorable drag next week, I can give you some tips. You need to get into the Drag Race gig. I've got so many of my viewers into the Drag Race gig. You know who you are, but honestly, please watch Drag Race because it's sick and I'm so so excited for this season. There's always a moment in like when the new season starts where I'm like, oh, I hope it's as good as the last season because I think one of the best seasons was season 5, that was my favourite, and season 3. I really liked season 6 as well, a lot of people's favourites was season 6, let's be honest, like Bianca, Adul, like that was a lot of people's favourites. I always leave a mess with the glitter. Honestly, it goes on, on my floor, it goes on my wooden floor, the glitter is just like the devil, I swear to you. May have gone a little bit thick with the eyeliner. I popped the liner into the crease a little bit as well. I hope and pray that this is a night where my actual makeup looks nice. You know when you have to go to like an actual like event where you want to look pretty or like handsome or whatever and everything just messes up? Like, I hope it's not one of those nights. I'm blending that crease a little bit with my indigo blue crease shade. Pop the deep purple and the mermaid shade right there onto my lower. I'm popping the blue like super low, just because it's drag honey. I'm gonna be using some collection glitter, this is called Le Freak. Just pop that onto the bottoms. Okay, so, <laughs> so I am going to be using, <laughs> okay, I'm, <laughs> I'm popping some cream crush eyeshadow in number five from Kiko, like this is just beautiful, like, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm not going, <laughs> just pop that into the inner, I am also going to put a little bit of black into my waterline, so you've known me for like a long time now, Emily, and how clumsy am I? Very clumsy. Like? Extremely clumsy. I'm gonna pop these lashes on, you know, I gotta go thick with my lashes because I like things to be thick. Look at the difference between my two eyes. Like, I think that's actually crazy. I'm just gonna brush off my beat. And she's looking real tan today. Makeup Revolution Contour Palette, you know, you know the tea. I'm gonna be using this one right here, and contour, and bronze. I'm gonna contour this nose and whittle this nose down. No, 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 <laughs> no, 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 no way. No, 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 no way, I'm living with him. Yeah. I'm going to be using my Kiko Blending Wave Multicolor Blush in number 3 and this is called Expressive Biscuit, I think it's called, is it? Yeah, it's called Expressive Biscuit, I love the packaging, it's a peachy colour. It's like an ombre blush, I love it. I half bought it because of the packaging, not gonna lie, like let's be honest, like I bought it for that. Uh, for a highlight, I gotta get that highlight girl, so I'm gonna be using my Becca Champagne Pop highlighter. Just using a fan brush, the one fan brush that I use is Royal and Magnacle. I wanna get some MUA brushes as well for my videos, because they're quite cheap and I wanna see like how good they are, and I've tried MUA brushes in the past and they've actually, they're actually quite good, you know. They should really bring them out in Super Joke, because a lot of people don't know that um, MUA have got brushes, but they do, they're just online. I'm gonna use my little fan brush right here. Let me revamp the brow bone and highlight the nose. Ooh, ooh. This little fan brush is cute. For the lips, I'm going to be using Le Beau Cosmetique in Violette. 
It's kind of royal blue though, let's be honest, it's more of a royal blue. It's a glitter liquid lipstick, so it turns matte, but obviously it's got glitter in it. So I've just glued my wig down, and this is from, where is it from? It's from bobbypins.com. This is it, my choker is from chokemejewelry.com. I was cooking. Do you know, okay, so this is like the edge of the blade. I cut, I somehow, I cut it with like the edge, not with the actual sharp part, just like the top part. I don't know how, but it just started bleeding and it didn't even hurt. I'm finding it really hard to like, do stuff basically. I can't write very well and like I can do my makeup because like makeup's like really gentle but like I've been having to do a lot of things like brushing my teeth with like my last dominant hand and I'm like not ambidextrous so it's so it's just annoying me so much. I just thought to mention it. It's really annoying me. <laughs> so this is my top. I don't like to wear boobs to be honest. So I'm flat chested fish. I would like to say that I'm prepubescent. That is from newdress.com and I'll leave the link in the bottom bar. Please give this video a thumbs up. I'm out BC and Raja tonight. I know my friend Amy Wade is really jealous. So I'm sorry Gert, but we're gonna go see another drag show together, I'm sure. Please subscribe for more drag videos and everything like that so that's it guys bye